Hey you guys, it's Shannon, and you're on my channel, oh my. And I think I'm gonna play with makeup. I am no professional by any means. So, that being said, <clears throat> try not to criticize too harshly, please. I am going to jump off real quick and do my face primer and get my foundation on. And I am still working on my empties to get rid of. So let me show you real quick what I'm going to use. My face primer is the Unique Face Primer. And I'm just like down to there, you guys. I can't wait. My brow is the Brow Obsession Palette by Unique. And then of course, the foundation is Unique. I'm working on it. I already got rid of one. You guys seen that already. Yay! I am so happy on that. And then the concealer, which I am almost got one empty, and then I will start another one if I can find it. You guys know how that is, right? There's the concealer, but I think it's about done. Maybe there's a little bit, but if not, I've got another one that I'm going to start using because I'm really, I've been really good on going to this here when I put my makeup on. So that being said, that has really just done a lot for me. So let's get this on real quick, okay? Um, yeah, I always have to paint those on if I'm going to put makeup on because my brows are so blonde you can't see them. I was trying to think of what colors to play with tonight. But I think I'm going to go... <clears throat> Actually, you know what I can do? Because... It is in my project pan over here, and unfortunately, it's, but fortunately, it's unique, and it is nothing but purples, so we're going to work with this one, because then that gives me a little bit that I'm going to just, I've got to get rid of this stuff so I can play with my other pretty stuff. Um, I'm going to go in this palette here, and I'm going to use this color right here as a base. That color is, if I can read it, elated. So that way I'll have a little bit of a base, and then we'll just work from there. And... I don't know the name of this brush, y'all. I don't know. I don't. And so we're just going to get that on there. And that will give me a little something that I can kind of... And it's light enough that it's not going to affect the color of the purples. <coughs> Excuse me. How is everybody's weekend going after Christmas? Did anybody go shopping? Did you have returns to do? Or did you just go hit the clearance? I had to go to Walmart and we went there. What would we, I'm trying to 
trying to think of what I went for. I had to go for something. I picked up a few things that were clearance now, but nothing really got my fancy. <clears throat> so I'm just like, okay. Um, but my daughter, my oldest daughter and I went. So we, <coughs> we got, <clears throat> you know, a few things. Okay, I'm gonna go in with this color right here first. gonna see how it works if it doesn't work real good as far as the pigment wise then I know that it is time to just chunk it but it looks like it's gonna prove me wrong okay much as I can and I've been trying to get everything organized and it's just like oh my gosh crazy but okay 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 so I got that on but I'm going to blend it out if I can find my blending brush. But I think this one here will do. So we're gonna get this and we're just gonna blend it. And blend. It's actually very soft. Which is fine. I don't order all my comfort, you know, you guys, I haven't done a makeup video in like four months. And I just, so many of the ladies have been inspiring me that I've been meeting on YouTube and Instagram. And, you know, it's like, I'll give it a whirl. That's what I was, you know. Okay, I'm going to go in with this darker color and Cradulous, I think is the name of it. I don't know. And I'm just gonna get it, I'm gonna go right in the corner. We're gonna darken that up. And I'll blend it out, of course. And we'll see. You guys hear them? I just want to get it a little darker. The foliage or the fallout or the debris, whatever you may want to call it, is not too bad. So, I know I see a lot of people put their eye makeup on first and then they do their coverage. I am just so used to doing my coverage first. Maybe I need to change that. I don't know, but well, I don't really want to use it. Here we go. I I gotta find my brushes, you guys. My my stuff's all a mess. Okay, here we go. I'm just gonna get this. I'm gonna soften it out. And then there's a little bit of foliage in here, but I'll go and I'll clean that up. After I was so rudely interrupted. You guys know how it goes, right? Maybe. Oh well. Uh, so we're going to finish blending. I did not do any of this because I had to leave my little sanctuary here. I guess if that's what you want to call it. I do think that I'm gonna go in darker with that color. Just right in there. And these two 
two that I'm working with right now, they look like they're uh, more of a metallic or maybe a shimmer. try not to be on here real long you guys because you know I just I try I do but if you get bored I totally get it I totally get it oh my gosh my husband and I I got a mirror here and a mirror here, and I'm looking <clears throat> to see. Anyway, my husband and I have been married for almost 29 and a half years. And we take little road trips, but we've never gone on like a vacation type road trip. And you guys know what? We're going on a road trip, just me and him, no kids, not work related, and we are going to just, we're, we got, <clears throat> we're going to rent a car, and we are just going to drive, see where we can go, and, okay. I'm just using some concealer <clears throat> to put on right in here. So maybe the next purple shade will pop some because it's a very light shade. We want that bad boy to pop. And then... Oh, I think I did that just about even, y'all. How about those cookies? Okay. I'm going to go in with this color right here, and I'm going to put it right there where I just put the concealer at. I have got eye primer, but I just put my face primer on my eyes, and I'm just tapping it in. Now, mind you, this is probably not a look that I would go out in. Because it's just not um I'm not that bold yet. Maybe I'll get that bold. Who knows? You never know, right? Everybody's doing their own thing this evening, as of right now. Yepers. Okay. Now, what I'm going to do, my finger is really, well, no, maybe not. Okay. I'm going to go in with this color here, and it's, it's really pretty. And I'm just going to take my finger right here. I'm just going to mash it in there, press it, I normally don't use my fingers in my eyeshadows, I have a real fear of pink eye, but nobody else uses my stuff, so. And I don't use nobody else's stuff. I just have a, that's just one of my things. I, I don't. 
<clears throat> I don't even, you know, let my daughters use my mascara. Okay, I am going to take another brush, if I can find one. I've got stuff all over the place. I'm just like lost and confused. Dazed and confused. Oh, I need stuff that's just falling all over the place. I have another box here that I just like threw everything in of, um, you know, just little stuff because I was cleaning, um, going through our stuff that, that we, um, well, not that we, that I got for Christmas. And I was just, oh, there we go. This, this one here will work. And I was just like, oh my gosh, what am I going to do? Okay, I'm going to take this brush here. It's kind of poofy, fluffy. And I'm going to go in with this color again. And I'm going to go right up here just to give it maybe, I'm hoping, a little bit of a shine. Maybe you guys can see it. I don't know. Now remember, I'm no makeup artist. I am not a professional. That would be kind of awesome if I was. Okay. Then, I'm going to take this brush here. And I'm going to take this darker color that I've used on the corners. And I'm going to go underneath on my, right below my waterline. This really isn't the right brush, but that's okay because I can probably get away and smoke it out. Maybe, maybe. And this is just like an all purple, purple, purple look. And let's see, I'm going to take this, I'm going to smash this brush here, and I'm just going to lighten that line up a little bit, just so it's not so harsh. Okay. Oh, you guys, way out of my comfort zone, but hey. Okay, I'm going to do some contour, and I am, this is from my empties that I'm using, and it is a stick. It actually is a double-sided. This side is already done. This is concealer, and then this here, or highlight, well, I think it's concealer, um, and this is a contouring, so we're just going to. I'm, I'm trying. Did you guys see that? I just broke it off. It's no good. Oh my gosh. Oh well. I tried. I had that issue. It happened on the other side too. The um, the concealer one. That's fine. So she's done. She's done. Well, those are some purple eyes. Really, really purple eyes. Okay. Then, let's see if I can find it. That's not good. I found it. Okay, this one here I was very, very excited about because Christmas Eve, I was getting ready, and you guys, I hit pan. Can you see that pretty thing? I hit pan. Felt like I was never going to get it. I seen the indentions, and I was just like, oh my gosh, it's never going to happen. And then it happened. Just unexpectedly, I got the pan. And then, we're just going. 
going to put this bad boy here. And then I'm going to take my big floofy, my big brush here, and I'm just going to kind of, hopefully it doesn't look so harsh. I hope. Okay. Since I haven't forgotten, and I'm going to do it now, I'm going to take cutting spray. And I'm going to go ahead and go over my face. This is Unique Setting Spray. It smells really awesome. Um, yeah, I like it, but I've got other stuff in there that I want to use also and give it a whirl. Okay. Now that I got that done, you know, I look for something and I can never find it. And then when I don't need it, I'll find it. So I just set that up with it's my lip scrub. Okay. And we're going to do mascara, and then I'm going to hop off of here. I'm going to do my lips, and I'm going to put some falsies on, and then I'll be back. But I'm going to let's do the mascara. This mascara is the Rodial. Mascara, double A, large. So, um, she's almost done, you guys. Almost. And it's amazing what mascara does uh, as far as to finish a look off, but it's even... Ama more amazing how falsies really put a pop to it. You know, if I was going out on a date night with my husband, I would probably do this. We used to go dancing all the time. But he quit doing that because he quit drinking, which is a total blessing. And so when you go dancing, especially at country and western bars, what do you get? You gotta have a beer. You got to. Okay, let me go and get the falsies on and I'm gonna put some lips on and I'll be right back. Guys, I'm back. This is my finished look. Tell me what you think down below. I can take criticism. No worries. But try not to be too nasty, please. But let's recap on what I use. <clears throat> okay, so for my primer, I am finishing off my Touch Glorious Unique Face Primer. I'm almost there, you guys. So close, yet so far away. But you know what the problem is? I think I got another one I got to use. But, okay, at least I'm getting that done. And then this is a palette that I built myself through Unique <coughs> back when I was a presenter. And it is a purple palette. And I used all four colors. And all these are in my project pan. Um, this is the color Lippy I use with a lip liner. Let me see. Here's the lip liner. And here's the lip liner. And... Also, it's in my project pan, and look at how little that bad boy is. Yes, I am getting somewhere with him, too. Okay. And then, of course, for my base, on my eyeshadow, I use this color right here, just to get me started. Um, the mascara was the Rodile Mascara. Whoa. Drop. Powder. Is, this is what I use. The Airspun. And then my foundation, I use the touch, uh, the mineral touch liquid foundation with the BB cream. I mix them together because it's the closest that I could get in my shade. Yeah. I use for my blush, it is the unique limited edition, and the color is serene. I actually really like this color. 
and it is the one that I'm so happy about that I finally hit pan. And then for the contour, I used, it's a contouring stick with a concealer on one side. And you guys were with me, and it broke off. So, yeah. That one's bye-bye. And then the setting spray is the unique setting spray. And that is it, you guys. So, yeah. Tell me what you think. It's been a while since I've done a video on makeup with you guys. So, be gentle if you can. But, if not, that's okay. But, until the next video, you guys take care. Please be safe because another holiday is fast approaching us. And it is almost time to ring in the year 2021. Woohoo! Can't wait. <sighs> Praise Jesus. It's going to be awesome no matter what. We can triumph. <laughs> Majorly triumph. So, oh, the lashes. Before I forget, I got these lashes. It's Glamnetic. They're magnetic eyelashes. I actually love them, you guys. And the style is Baby Girl. I got this in a gift or a giveaway by... Miss Rhonda said, I believe. I don't know. I'd have to go back and look. But anyways, these are awesome, you guys. I really do like them. Um, I'm going to start probably looking for more magnetic lashes because I don't have to fight with the freaking um, glue. But I need to work on it because I got a lot of lashes that, you know, is glue lashes. But anyways, until the next video, you guys, take care. God bless and peace.